friends, how are you? Welcome. I'm so excited to talk to you today about the Martha, but first I just want to address the hair. For those of you, just a small change here, just a little one. Um, for those of you, I know it is um, coming across with mixed reviews. For those of you that love it as much as I do, sad, sad news. For those of you who hate it and thought I was so pretty before, um, don't worry, it's not going to last. But sad news for those of us that love it as much as I do. It's just color depositing conditioner. Um, it'll come out in depends how much, how often I wash my hair and whether or not my hair touches the chlorine. Also, always remember to use gloves. Um, my, my nails were milky white. Now they're kind of milky pink, which I'm kind of digging. But um, this is after washing my hands uh, with soap and shampoo multiple times. I know that I should have worn gloves. I didn't have any, so here we are. But I'm obsessed with this. This is fresh. Just did it this morning. So as each day goes by for the rest of the week, I'm sure it'll get lighter and light and lighter. But I did already text my hair girl and say, um, hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm going to have to take all the pictures today because I'm obsessed with it. I know. Not everybody loves it, including my very own husband. But anyways, that is not the point. Today, the point is to talk to you about the Martha Square Neck Tea. I love me a good square neck. It is hip to be square. I know. And the same day I'm trying to tell you it's hip to be square, I am doing crazy things with my hair, which makes me crazy and hip to be crazy. I don't know. Anyways, hip to be square. We have the great square neck Martha T. So this is her. Super super simple, super cute, right? Um, so we did just recently see the Marissa, which was also a square neck. That one was a little bit wider, not quite so sharp of an edge. You can see we have that like real square neck. I don't even have a Martha anymore uh, or a Marissa anymore. Uh, they uh, The last one just sold, but it was a little bit more rounded and a little bit bigger. This one, you can see it's a little bit closer to the neck and an and actual like square. We've got, it comes to a point in everything. So this is a little bit different. The last one, the Martha or the Marissa, they have to, they had to both start with M's. Just screw me up all kinds. The Marissa was a much more structured, um, fabric. So this one is a two by two rib. It's also, um, they said was supposed to come in a textured knit and there are no textured knits in my box that I saw, which only can mean that we're going to have a restock eventually someday. I mean, it could be next week. It could be tomorrow or it could be in like three months. I don't know, but they did say texture knit material, and um, these are all two by two rib, which I love the two by two rib, but that texture knit, mwah, I love it. If you saw our alley video or you tried the alley, um, those came in a, um, I know I'm just comparing to all of the styles, those came in a jersey material and the textured knit, which um, is kind of that ribbed material, had a little bit of design to it. I actually have, I have Allie over here somewhere just to try and remind you that. So that is actually textured knit. I don't know that these would be exactly the same, um, but from pictures I've seen, I believe so. And I loved that material. So um, not to say there is anything wrong with this one. This one is a two by two ribbed material. So it's got a little bit of silkiness to it. We've seen this in some other pieces before. It does have good stretch. This one does have a little bit more structure to it than the textured knit. Not nearly as much as the Marissa, which was our other square neck that was the um, almost like that Liverpool. It was a jacquard. It was thicker, very, very structured, and it had that little poof um, in the sleeve. And a little bit shorter of a sleeve as well. This is just your base basic kind of tee with a fun neck. So this one is definitely a lot easier to kind of dress up or dress down. That Marissa felt very, um, a lot more formal, I would say. Well, I loved it. Um, but definitely, I mean, great for the office. And while this is great for the office, this does feel a little bit more relaxed for, um, going to the store, going to shopping, going out to dinner, going out to lunch, going out to brunch. Clearly I'm hungry. I haven't eaten today. Um, so loving this. Also, you guys, we are a solid five minutes in almost, oh, I guess four minutes. It does count for me right there. Um, and I have not even introduced myself. So hello, my name is Katie. I just talked to you all like you should already know because you should all have already been like, oh my God, your hair is totally different. And really there was probably these people on here that are like, who the hell is this chick and why is she telling us about her hair? Thought we were here to talk about clothes. Anyways, my name is Katie and this is Capturing Fashion with Katie. We're a little girl boutique and today we are talking about the Martha. So here we are. Now, 
um, told you kind of all her details. We've just got a basic short sleeve. We've got that nice crisp um, square neck. Again, a little bit um, smaller than the Marissa. The Marissa definitely went wider and was a little bit more rounded. And then we have just a nice, it looks like a nice straight across hemline here. Um, decent length. It's going to cover all of the things that you needed to cover um, and not while well, also not being too long. So great to wear with denim shorts, which is what I'm wearing today, which guys, by the way, these are two-year-old shorts shorts. Um, we have not seen a restock in these in a very long time. And as I understand it, we will not be. However, I do have a handful of them available right now, but they're not going to last for very long. These are like an anomaly. It's like amazing that I even have them. So if you have missed those, telling you, especially if you're a size 36, we have all the washes. We have a lot of black. Anyways, it doesn't matter. That's what it's Martha. It's Martha's time now. Martha's time. Uh, Martha's Vineyard. Okay. No. So <laughs> I don't, I, I'm everywhere. It's a Monday. Hey, um, so I need to talk to you now about the fit, right? So I am wearing a large right now, which is my true size, my size chart size, that uh, size chart for this one. And as for like all the foreseeable future, I believe um, we've officially changed our size chart to instead of kind of bouncing back and forth. I mean, for all I know, we'll launch something else and it'll be a little bit different and they'll change the size chart. But overall, they're kind of sticking with this 810 as a medium and a 1214 for a large, um, a 1618 for an extra large. Um, this is kind of industry standard for sizing. A 1214 is a large. So that's kind of what we're keeping it um, with. Now, sometimes we have some things that run a little bit bigger, a little bit smaller, and I recommend sizing up or sizing down or not even um, that you should, but that you could and all of that kind of stuff. But the size charts for this is how it's supposed to fit. There we go. Um, how it was supposed to fit. So this is the intended fit of this garment. Um, it means that if you could size down and have it to be tighter, or you could size up and have it be looser, and that is up to you and your own personal preference, but the intended fit is this, and it's very nice. It is not too tight. It is not too relaxed. It's just your, it's just, it's just a perfect fit. It's just perfect. Now, I honestly, I absolutely um, believe, I honestly believe, I do, I honestly and absolutely, yes, believe that I can wear a medium. It's going to be a little bit more form-fitted and, and I can wear an extra large. It's going to be a little bit more oversized. This neck is nice and small, so I don't feel like the neck is going to get too big in sizing down or sizing up. Um, and it's going to get a little bit tighter to size down, but um, I feel like I'll be able to do it. It's going to depend on my mood that day and if I'm having a skinny or a fat day. I've talked about that a lot. You guys know how, it roll, how, how we roll as women, but I um, am a medium or large in a lot of LuLaRoe. Um, a lot of large right now. I promised myself I would lose some weight and I didn't, so we're halfway through the year now. It's going to be 2024's problem, but for 2023, I've been a solid large all um, year long, and that's really been like my sweet spot. I've still been able to spit all over and not know how to talk, but I've also still been able to wear mediums and a lot of things, but I've been happiest in a large because we've had so many things that are just fitting perfection in your true size with, um, just not too much relaxed. I don't feel like my tummy is on display. So this is just really, really nice. Now, it would not be one of my fit videos if I did not try on other sizes as well. So I am still going to put on a medium for you. I am going to put on an extra large for you. We're going to see how all of that works. So let's do that right now with the medium next. All right, this one matches my hair. Um, all right, so this one is a medium. It is pulling a bit. This is a ribbed material, so you can see when it pulls, it gets a little bit, this one gets a little bit lighter um, because it's pulling. And obviously, if you've watched me before, then you know I have a lot going on right through here. Um, and so do some of the, the weird men that also watch these and leave weird comments. Sometimes, yes, I have a lot going on right here. So um, it does pull a little bit. You can see where it's much lighter across here than it is my tummy. So it's not pulling too much on my tummy. Um, so it is still definitely doable in that area, but it is now much more form fitted. And I just don't feel like the fit of that large needed to be sized down. You know what I mean? Like I don't feel like there's a reason to make it this much tighter. It's a little bit tighter in the arms. Material has great stretch though, so it's not like killing me. Uh, I got this a little bit of pulling on the neck here again because it's a little bit bigger. Um, or I mean, a little bit smaller and I have more of a broad shoulder as well. So it's kind of pulling across not only here, but across the back and making this neck pull a little bit more than it needs to. Um, so if 
I did not have such broad shoulders and such a large chest. This medium would still definitely work, but I'm obsessed with the large and the way that that one fit. Because, again, this one is fitted. Um, and I could definitely wear it, especially if I wanted to tuck in. Uh, but, uh, except, again, the girls, it's making it, it's pulling the, the pattern a little bit. It's pulling that color a little bit. But it's still definitely doable. But there's not really much of a point, I feel, like in sizing down. Whatever your size, chart size is, guys, if you have lost some weight recently, and while Katie has stayed the same or gained some, don't be like, well, I have to do a large, because Katie did a large. No, I mean, if you are an 810, then do a medium. If you are a 1214 like I am, do a large, unless you want it to be more fitted. Or maybe you want it to be a little bit more relaxed, because that's the thing too, and I've definitely seen some retailer friends doing this, and it looks super, super cute, so let's try the extra large as well. All right, and extra large. So this isn't awful at all. You can definitely see that it's much more relaxed. Well, obviously, much more relaxed than the medium was. It is a little bit more relaxed than that large. Not horrible. The neck is still nice. I don't see any bra straps. I don't see any cleavage, anything like that. So it's still nice and modest. Um, but there is lots of room. So definitely doable. I definitely can see where some of you who like your things more relaxed would like this as well. But I also feel like those of you who do also like your things more relaxed will still like that large as well. Because again, it's just kind of that perfect medium between the two. Sometimes if you go too relaxed on certain things, um, then it just... Sometimes it makes you look frumpier and sometimes it doesn't. It just kind of depends. Um, I don't feel like this is horrible. I feel like a lot of you are going to love this print and this color. But um, large was just chef's kiss for me. So if I'm going out, I'm searching for um, my favorite in my size, I'm going to go with large. Um, that's the size that I'm going to probably keep. And that's the size that I am going to search for. I did lay down. Do you know we have these tags in here? So that was sticking out a little crazy. So I just laid it down. Um, if you've ever wondered, these RFIG, RFGI, RF, some for other other tags. Um, these are for tracking. These are in a lot more clothing than just LuLaRoe. My, all my Victoria's Secret bras have them. Um, there's a little dotted line there because you can just cut that out once you get it. But this is for like, our inventory tracking and you know how um so i can find see what's in my box all of that good stuff so um those are in lots of clothing but sometimes when you forget to cut them out they stick out a little funny and sometimes that happens here in these videos because i'm all in a rush and i'm not paying attention to what's happening and then we got all that okay anyway um it's cute large was great my hair is fire <laughs> I'm so, i like it so much you guys i like it so so much i don't worry it's not staying but i do still have some of that conditioner it was not the whole bottle so don't be surprised if this pops into a video again in the future um also i don't actually know how long it will last not very but you might see when I, you might see it in some more videos kind of coming up but anyways overall true size guys go with your size short size and you will be perfection that's always where you should start and then from there you can kind of decide if you want to size up or down but really that true size was just perfect um i hope that you love it i cannot wait to share these with you tonight um if you are in my group and you are watching this on the day that i make it i really hope that you will be on the live tonight because i have one other thing to share with you guys tonight and i really hope that you don't miss it. Okay. I hope so. I will see you guys tonight. Um, if you are not already, I just had some, one of you join. Welcome. I love it. If you are not already though, come find me on Facebook, capturing fashion with Katie. Uh, that is my group, my fashion community over on Facebook. Um, I am always open to helping if you need anything or asking, answering any questions. That's where all of the magic happens. Or you can always check out my shopping website, but much more personal experience over there. If you would love it, I would love it if you would come and join me over there, Capturing Fashion with Katie on the Facebooks, on the Instagram, on the threads, on the TikToks, all of the things. All right. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a little bit of love below. Subscribe to my channel. I make new fit videos for every new style we get, sometimes some old ones. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.